Hey there, this is Jonas Manyways here and I'm going to play Blitz Jazz again resign now, thanks and I'm going to have this weird set of pieces where it's really hard to distinguish the different types of of pieces involved, this is the queen and the other letters denoting the pieces are the same that are used in classical chess notation but still it's very weird because you're not, or I'm not used to that at all usually pieces do have a visual appearance you can relate to and this is not really possible here anymore there's the bishop, you could check the king here and the deeper you are in the position, the less the place where a piece is on the board helps you determining which type of piece it is. The rook here could try to get something in on that e-file, half open and heading towards the king. Oh, and to make it more weird yet, I have decided to use the pink set of pieces. Um, where to go with that knight? I, I want to open the file or the way for this bishop here. Uh, where can that bishop go? It probably has to go back, back quite a bit. Yeah, probably in front of the rook. It does feel a little like playing blind chess to me. Um, but we'll see how I will manage in the long run. Perhaps I can do this. Offering the pawn exchange here. Where does that knight want to go? Here, here. I think that's both okay with me if he goes here. Oh, there's that nasty fork. So yeah, I guess I would have seen that if I did have normal pieces but I don't have and so I didn't see that let's see what we, oh let's not drop one more this one is protected at least I got a weird for a pawn there on c3 now perhaps I can support him by d4 let's see about that or alternatively bishop to b4 Mm, I guess this one is required first because the bishop and the knight were hitting this pawn on d5. So I first had to take care of that. He's offering the exchange. Should I go for that? I think I have to. And let's now try to get those pawns rolling. I don't know if that can possibly work. Uh, he's castling away. What about this bishop here? One minute left. Let's get it to here. Oh, dropping the pawn. Resign now, thanks. It's a little stronger than I am in Blitz right now. And I s assume that's, that this is what you just see here. I have to exchange. Saving this pawn, at least for now. This pawn is protected. Whoops, by his friend back on the other square. Let's see what we can do. Quickly protect him more and try to push him. Rook's on the file with the rolling pawn. About a minute of time left. I'm trying to get in something here. But of course, I overlooked important stuff, which quite quite often happens to me, and it's not easier having those pieces, that board, and any excuse you can imagine, that's probably the reason why this is not working for me. <laughs> no, seriously, I'm just playing badges here. It's a little more simple than I might want to have it. Can I get anything in here anymore? Probably not. No, he's taking here. No, he's taking there. And it's about time to give up, I guess. Uh, there's no way to win this and I'm down on time too I can try to sneak in some stalemates perhaps but he doesn't seem like the opponent who would allow that 
lost my last uh, pawn here let's see if you can convert this it's not too hard I guess he can push any of the pawns and now uh, he does and there's nothing I can do about it he's gonna queen here uh, can't do that I uh, need to try to stay in the center there is a chance to uh, stalemating ideas because of the complexity of the situation there's this uh, rook queen and bishop on the same board with even two pawns uh, doing nasty stuff but I guess that's it that's mate thank you for playing resign now thanks and I could actually I should actually have three sign now but yeah I didn't so <laughs> you still get the points and see you next time thank you for playing goodbye